books are not so popular right now since social medias have dominated our lives. From I was little until secondary school, I loved reading so much. I could read up to three 100 pages of non-fictional books in one week. And I could remember what I was reading. Now, I don't even know how many books I currently have. But after secondary school, which is the period where I started to really use smartphones, I began to get distracted and spent quite a time on social media. Ultimately, I lost interest in reading books. So what? Has reading in this era became irrelevant? If not, will it become irrelevant one day? People, especially the elders, keep telling the current generation how wasteful it is for us to not have the ability to sustain our attention in reading. This will allegedly lead us to the lack of knowledge. Is this true though? Try to think about this. There are a lot of beneficial videos delivered effectively that can make us gain knowledge more efficiently than us trying to read the book worth the same value, which may take longer time to read and digest. There are also a lot of useless books being sold in the market. And not surprisingly, the demand for this kind of books is higher than the demand for the beneficial one. And of course, there are a lot of rubbish content online. And the demand for these things is also higher than the demand for actual beneficial content. So what does this mean? I don't think the question is, has reading became irrelevant or not? I don't think the main focus is about the printed physical books either. The main focus is actually the content and how much it has changed. For a very long time, people consume content through physical material. Only after the rise of technology and gadgets, new ways to deliver contents also rise. But the book industry, or generally the physical content industry, is a long industry, or a mature industry, I shall say. They already have systematic ways to deliver content. So they at least seem to focus on producing valuable content. Online content, on the other hand, is a new thing. People are still trying to figure out how it works. So the best way to figure it out and get profit at the same time to sustain it is to produce what people mostly demand. And obviously, entertainment has always been one of the top demands. I believe that one day, online content industry will mature, just like how physical content industry did. And it too will have more systematic ways of delivering content. Then we'll see how we can mainstream values and goodness into it, just like what we did with books. So back to the question, is reading still relevant? Yes. But let's not worry about that because despite whatever medium that we have, the content that we are consuming is the key. The question of whether reading is still relevant or not is irrelevant in the first place, to me at least. Maturity, maturity, maturity. That level of maturity, mature, mature, nature, mature, nature, of maturity, ma nature, <laughs> maturity.